and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here and you've just stumbled on this video for the first time, then hello, my name is Nicola and I'm a mum of two and I make lifestyle videos. So today's video is in collaboration with the lovely people at Mapiful who got in touch with me and asked if I would like to receive one of their wonderful prints and I jumped at the chance and it's actually enabled me to do a job that I have wanted to do for quite some time. So Mapiful are on a mission to bring joy into your homes through the medium of customizable wall art. They produce fantastic quality prints in the form of maps, so classical maps, uh, star maps, zodiac maps, and their new text art. Their prints come in a variety of sizes and you can customize the colors in them to ma match your decor. And you can also choose where in the world you want a map from. So when I went onto the website, it was very easy to navigate and to decide what I wanted. And I knew that I wanted a classic map because I wanted something that was a memory for us. Um, I know a lot of people will get a map of the place that they live or the place that they grew up. However, Andrew and I didn't grow up in the same place. Our children did, weren't all born in the same places. So it was quite difficult to think of where we would want a map of. And I didn't want just something that was um, special to me, I wanted something that was special to all of us. So we decided to get a map of Florida, particularly the south of Florida, because we have traveled quite a bit throughout that area and we have some amazing memories of holidays there. So I will show you the map that I chose. It is this one, whether you can see particularly well, I'll show you more when I've got it up on the wall. Um, and it says Florida, um, United States, our happy place. And it is absolutely our happy place. It's the place where we have holidayed most. Um, we didn't really go on abro holidays abroad until Phoebe was two years old and we went to France for the first time and we got the travel bug almost instantly. And we had our first trip to America, to Vegas, when uh, we went for Andrew's 40th. Um, although Andrew and I had been to Florida on holiday before we had children. In fact, it was our first holiday together. And we always wanted to go back there. And then we, we went to Disney when Phoebe was four. And then we went back and we went to Naples in Florida uh, the following year. And then last year, no, year before last, we went on a road trip um, from Key West to Key Largo, up to Orlando, back to Miami. Um, so Florida has a very, very special place in all of our hearts. We were supposed to be going back to Disney, as you may know if you watch my videos regularly, we were supposed to be going back um, in July this year, and obviously because of circumstances, that's not been able to happen. So to have this map um, to remind us of the wonderful holidays we've had and hopefully the wonderful holidays that we'll have again in the future um, is really special. So I will link all the details for Mapiful down below. Um, go on, have a look. Uh, the maps are really, really good value and you can um, choose all sorts of different options and uh, find something that's special for you and for your family. So the job that I had needed to do is the picture rails, well, picture um, shelves that are behind me in our living room. I had thought about doing the ones in our bedroom, which do need doing, but these ones are a better size for a larger print like this one. So um, I have decided to print off some photographs of memories of the holidays we've had in Florida. I thought that would be a really good idea to go alongside the map. Um, we've had some pictures up here, just random ones from other holidays, Phoebe's dancing pictures, which we love, but they don't really have um, they don't really fit as such with the decor in this room. And also the other images we have in this room are all of holidays on um, places that we've been. So um, there are a couple of images over on the wall over there looking at me, which are from Prague, where Andrew and I went on a holiday many years ago. Um, and then there's a big picture behind our sofa of um, North Devon, which is actually where Andrew grew up. So I thought it made sense to have more travel images on the wall here and in blacks and whites because most of the images, the pictures we've got in here are also in black and white. So I will show you how it looks now. It's a bit empty because I've had to use some of the frames. I will explain because obviously a lot of shops are closed. I would normally go to Ikea to buy all my frames. I think just about every frame apart from the pictures that have been professionally framed. Nearly all of our other pictures are framed with frames from um, Ikea but Ikea is closed at the moment and are taking a long time to deliver and I didn't want to have to wait 
two months to get a frame. So I did order some frames on Amazon. The actual, the frame that the map is in, I am not entirely happy with. So I do want to get another one when I can go to the shops to buy one. The other frames, the smaller ones, I've either used ones I already had with other pictures in, or I bought a pack of 10 frames from Amazon. I will link them below because actually they're really good. I think it was like 19.99 for 10 frames of all different sizes. So uh, I was really pleased with those. So I'll show you what it looks like now and then um, we'll have a go at making it look a bit more fancy. So these are the picture shelves as they look at the moment. Obviously you can see there are um, lots of missing pictures along the bottom. Um, this picture was is of the Moulin Rouge and um, Andrew and I bought when it's a canvas that we bought when we were in Paris, when we were very first together. So I do want to keep that, but I don't, I'm not gonna put it there. I'm gonna find somewhere else for that to go. Uh, this one I bought from Etsy and we've had for years. And I think it's probably just about time for that one to move. And this one I brought in Asda and it may well go in with a theme. I might leave it there, but I might remove it. We'll see. So I'm gonna take these ones down and then um, see what I can do with the new ones. done and this took a lot less time than I was expecting I I just didn't know whether the prints the, the photographs that I'd taken would be the right size whether I had um, frames that were big enough there is probably I probably want a slightly bigger one for next to the map but as I said I've had to make do with the print the frames that I've got around the house so I make once we can go to the shops I can buy some different ones um, but I'm really chuffed with the way it looks so I will show you now so here is the lovely map um, and you can see um, it, the frame I'm not entirely happy with. Um, as I said, I, I, I did order this one on Amazon and it's a very strange frame. I had to unscrew it to get the picture in. Um, so I will replace that when I can get to Ikea, but this is fine for now. Um, and it shows the map beautifully. Um, so the, the pictures that I've chosen are from the areas we've been, which is down here, Key West, Key Largo, Miami, Orlando, and then over this side in Naples and Sarasota. Um, so going over to the images I've used, this picture um, I took on the beach at Naples, Naples Beach in Florida. There's the pier, that's Archie, and there's Phoebe, you can just see in the sunset there. And then this one was taken on the same evening, and that's me and Andrew um, on the beach, and I think Archie must have taken that one. Uh, and this is the plant, I've stolen this plant from the kitchen. We're gonna struggle everywhere else in the house. It's gonna have things missing, I think. Um, I'm gonna have to go and get some more of these. This is just a, a fake plant from Ikea and the same with the pot, but it just looks perfect. It just adds a little bit of color um, to everything else that's black and white. This I bought from Etsy. I think it was £4.50. I will link it below, it just as Adventure Awaits. And I thought that linked in quite nicely with the theme. This picture of Andrew, um, Phoebe, Archie and Harry, in Disney Springs was taken when we went to um, we went to Florida two years ago and we did our Key West road trip and we went there and we've got an identical picture that was taken when we went to Orlando for two years previous to that um, we've got an identical picture so it's quite nice to have that one there this one also taken at Naples Beach um, and this one as well taken at Naples Beach. So in fact, all the pictures, these two and these two were all taken on the same holiday and then 
this one was taken on um, two years later. Um, I haven't got any of us actually in Disney World because I didn't think they necessarily fitted with the theme. Um, but I think these ones just fit perfectly. So I am so chuffed and they fit in nicely with the black and white piano. Um, and then the pictures we have on the wall over there. So we've got the black and white ones of Prague and then the Devon picture there. This one maybe doesn't fit in quite so well and that's Andrew Star Wars cards picture, but hey. And this one I need to get a new frame for, but again, I'm gonna have to wait until the shop's open for that. So I hope you like this video and I hope you like what I've done here. I'm really chuffed with it. If you do, please give this video a thumbs up. I will leave all the links to Mapperfort down below, so please go and check them out if you like my map and what I've done with my shelves. Um, thank you again to Mapperfort for collaborating with me on this video and I look forward to seeing you next time. Bye-bye.